What's going on, Kingdom? Hey, welcome to another episode of Trials of Mana. We left off uh, a few days ago. I haven't been recording for the last couple days because I have not been feeling too great, but I'm feeling a lot better now. I'm um, hopefully feeling even better by tomorrow, and then I will hopefully be getting some Resident Evil 8 content put out. I just haven't been able to do it uh, the last couple days. But uh, tonight I was just wanting to take it easy and go a little bit deeper into Trials of Mana and see where we can go from there. I really like this game, and I think it's beautiful. I think it's a lot of fun. If you haven't picked it up yet, definitely check it out, especially if you're watching this playthrough. It's amazing. So uh, make sure if you like the content that I'm putting out, make sure you hit that like and subscribe button. It really helps the channel. It helps me get on YouTube's algorithm. And it, uh, yeah, it helps us grow So and allows us to make more content. So without any further ado, let's get into this. Alright, looks like we are right here. It's the same thing. Okay. I don't know why I made two saves, but that's fine. <clears throat> Alright, so we did just get our first companion, I believe. Yes, we did. Okay. I believe that's okay. Yeah, we're going this way. Here we go. So I'm trying to remember all the the movements. Oh, careful! It's Danny. One down. Dark vision thanks to my blood. Don't worry. Got a medical herb. What does this say? Yeah, Holy City Window. That's where we're going to. So. Okay, we got what was over up there. It's just a medical herb or something like that. Oh, hey. There we go. Eight Lucra. Alright, what we got here? Chocolate. Ah, that's that chest we were looking at across the way. Cool. I know what to do. I don't know what the hell that was. Nope. I don't plan on getting caught in that, but I did. Dang it. Come on. It's a bit ridiculous. One down. You wish. No more enemies. Not until next time. Alright, so there was a wheel I can use, yeah. Um I don't remember how to read you. Ah, there we go. Alright, so I'm going to need something that's not as it's 17 candies. We'll use that. Should work. There we go. Wow. And there's health right there. Huh. Menace. Defeat it quickly and move. Next. Huh. <laughs> you wish. bats over here. I just look like it was breakable. All of us together. Oh yeah. So we can continue on out of the cave, or maybe the <gasps> second part of the cave. Oh, nope. Yeah, yeah, get him away. Nope. <gasps> nope. <gasps> there we go. <gasps> Alrighty, moving on.
dangerous here. Go home. Okay? I grew up with no parents, but there was one poison window that was always nice to me. Heath was kind and helpful. He took care of me. My grandpa asked Heath to go to Astoria to look into something for the temple. But I got a really, really bad feeling about it. I didn't want anything to happen to Heath. So I followed him in secret and didn't tell Grandpa when I left the temple that night. By a horrible twist of fate, <laughs> a creepy-looking man took Heath away Why right when I finally found him again. <laughs> hmm. I wonder if that's the Priest of Light that we're supposed to be finding. <laughs> and then I couldn't even get back to Wendell because of the barrier. Until you opened a path through the cavern. A little lost on the way and fell down. <laughs> if you hadn't been there, it would have been good night, Charlotte. That was close. <sighs> uh, fine. You can come with. On my way to Wendell to see the priest anyway. Oh, you want to see Grandpa? Why didn't you say so? You didn't know it, but you helped your chances. I'm actually the granddaughter of the Priest of Light. But, you know, Wendell isn't far from here. You might need my help getting there, but I don't need your help getting home. Take care that you don't get lost. Bye bye. Interesting. I am uh, somewhat glad uh, I didn't. Can she make it to Wendell her as alone? A teammate. <gasps> I had 17. Weird. Alrighty. Through the cave. candies there we go made back everything I used besides the missing eight that apparently we didn't use <gasps> Can I go down there nope <gasps> We're going to daytime. Okay, cool. Thought we were already in daytime, but I guess not. <coughs> Alright, where are we now? Wendell? Yep, there we go. Wendell! 
Wendell. I can bring Carl back. Thank you so much for taking me here. Hurry, we need to request an audience with his eminence. What is this? What kind of shop are you? Oh. I'll close until evening. It must be a bar. <clears throat> it's kind of neat. Back to the big tree. Huh. 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 Item seed, heck yes. Huh. Huh. Start growing our magic huh. pot a bit more. Sorry if you guys haven't noticed, I do like to kind of roam huh. around for a, a second to try to huh. find as much stuff as I can find. No, I don't want to talk to you. <laughs> On we go. Can I go through here? No. <laughs> yes, another item seed. I'd like to get those. <laughs> Nothing here. Check the other side, then we'll go in. Haha. Ha. 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 Looks like we can go ha. down there eventually, just not right now. Alright, let's go in. It's like, you never know what you're going to find in games like this where they let you like just free roam the buildings and stuff. It's like, yeah, okay, well, here's some stuff. So it's always good just to look around, see what you can find in most games like this. Because, like I said, you never know what you're going to find and it could be something that's going to help you greatly. You know, those item seeds are going to definitely help me grow my uh, magical pot, is what they're calling it. And that allows me to get better items. So it's kind of neat. Already went that way. We didn't go this way, though. Ha! Nothing. All right, cool. We can continue on then. Ha! Oops. Alrighty. Let's see what this guy's got to say. Please. Accept the goddess of manners' blessings. Priest! Carl! Bring Carl back! Friend! He's my only friend! Carl! The wolf pup! What is your name, son? I see. Hmm. Listen well, Kevin. The gift of life comes with the inevitability of death. 
Nothing can replace a life lost, nor bring back a soul who is no longer with us. That is why the gift is so precious. But death is simply how new life begins. Though Carl cannot return to his previous life, his soul will live on in your heart. Do you understand? But... Carl... He's... Keep the memory of him alive in your heart, young one. And someday, Carl may be reborn into your life again. Do not give up hope. No! This... This is the King's fault! Won't forgive him for what he did! To Carl! So, you're the Priest of Light, hmm? You're... Plainer than I expected. I was hoping you might have some wisdom to share. Whoa. <laughs> Wait! I have something to say. Your Eminence, please listen. I have come from the Sanctuary of Mana to tell you that the Mana Tree is withering. Mana power grows weaker by the day. <coughs> withering? But without the mana tree, the seals on the mana stones will break. The Benevidons will be released into the world. Benev... Bleven... No... What? You're acting like this doesn't affect you. You've been chosen by fairy. This means that you alone can retrieve the sword of mana from the sanctuary. What? Fairy? What's he talking about? I'm sorry. With the mana in the world so depleted, a fairy can't leave the sanctuary for long without a host. If I hadn't found you, I wouldn't have made it. Hey, but fairy's better now, yeah? We made it to Wendell. You do not need me anymore, so... Go to the old man instead. Would that I were able to bear your burden. However, once a fairy finds a host, they are bound to them for their whole life. Only death can part them. Huh? Don't need a mana sword. I need revenge on the one who hurt Carl. Can't get distracted. Kevin. I'm sure you already know you don't have the strength to defeat the King of Ferolia. Not with your power right now. But with the Sword of Mana, you would. What? Stronger than the King? Really? But what is the Sword of Mana? The Sword of Mana mm -hmm. is the embodiment of the ancient power of mana, guiding force of spirits. It is an alternate form of the golden wand used to create the world itself. The one who holds the mana sword gains awesome power. The sword lies in the roots of the mana tree, waiting. Before the mana tree withers completely, you must reclaim the sword and awaken the goddess of mana once more. She alone can bring peace to the realm and grant your wish. I... get that sword. I can defeat the king? Done! Where is the... Uh, um... Sanctuary of Mana. I am so sorry. But with Mana so depleted, I don't have enough power to open the portal to the Sanctuary. Not by myself. 
Throughout the world are eight points of mana energy. Mana stones, sealing away the fearsome Benevidons. If you activate the mana stones, the portal connecting our world to the sanctuary of mana should appear. Through that portal is the sanctuary. However, you should know that the energy inside the eight mana stones was sealed on purpose as the mana goddess began her slumber. What do I do? In ages past, there once was an ancient spell used to control the energy from the mana stones and bend it to the user's will. However, countries refuse to allow each other any control of the spell and use of the mana stones. The war that followed caused unspeakable damage. It was nearly as destructive as the sealed Benevidons. The survivors cursed the magic to avoid future tragedy and forbade anyone from using it. Now the life of any person who uses the spell will be forfeit. There is no longer anyone alive who knows how to work this cursed spell. No hope? There may be one way. If we borrow the powers of the elemental spirits that reside near the mana stones instead, I can combine their powers with what remains of mine to open the portal for everyone. Splendid! This is a relief. If you wish to find a mana stone, I've heard many say that the light stone is in Cascade Cavern, guarded by the elemental Lumina. It is the cavern you pass through in order to reach here. Take Fairy. With what remains of her power, she can help you find Lumina in the cavern. See if you may borrow his light powers. So, wait. The Sword of Mana? Huh. I think my mother mentioned that thing. But if I can get it before her... I can show her that I'm not powerless. She might even let me come back. Hey, take me with you. Please, come on. Certainly. And the more elementals we meet, the more magic you can learn yourself. Really? That's perfect. Priest of Light's faith has granted you the new ability. What new ability? Learn chain ability. Priest of Light chain ability. Base increase. Or base in HP increase by 30. Okay. So, I think we go back this way. <clears throat> Before we go out the front door, there is this back door I'm interested in. Okay, so there's what, nothing out here? It's just... I think there was also one more thing. There's doors out this way too that we didn't go to. Nothing over there. Oh, chest over here. <laughs>
food. Where's the inn? There's the inn. We could actually go sell some stuff too and see if they have magic uh, item seeds. Welcome. So let's Lots go to, buy. to browse. So he does not have item seeds. Oh, that's good. Deals water magic damage. Chance of freezing an enemy. Heck yeah. Lots of wares to browse. Hmm. <laughs> Come again. Anything right now. Other than those item seeds. Is there anything in here that I can get for free? Nope. Let's go to the armor shop since we still haven't gotten any armor. Hold up. Yeah, I thought so. 80. Heck yeah. Anything in here? Nope. Okay, let's talk to him. Welcome. Lots of wares to browse. Oh, it is plus two on both for her and for me. Oh, good choice. We'll use this. I love shopping. <laughs> Come again. <laughs> What's over here? Oh, that's where I already got that chest. Ground deep in the cavern, Cascade Cavern. Hmm. What are you doing over here? Okay. Oh, the weapon shop was over here. Ah, it's up here. Let's see if we can get her a weapon, because I know we already got one. Welcome. Lots of wares to browse. Yeah, we already have an iron knuckle. Oh, Let's good choice. Stash. I'll make use of this. <laughs> Come again. Okay. I think that's really all we need to do. So we can go ahead and get going on our path here. Be going back in here. Can I come with? Can I? Please. Since you have a quest of your own, I have a favor to ask. I gotta find Heath, and I need your help. No. Too little for a long journey. We will look for Heath. Little, huh? Why do people always assume I'm a baby? I'm 15 years old. Got it? Fifteen. Huh? But I'm fifteen. No, it does not matter. You can't come. Now go home. Priest was worried about you. Heh! <laughs> come on! I'm just worried about Heath. Please! I really can't come with you. Oh, fine. You are so stubborn. And mean. You, you... You meanie! Okay. Glad, glad you're not coming along.
Jeez, I can't even dodge. <laughs> There's mana power coming from the waterfall. See that strange hole? Further up. I bet Lumina is in there. Leveled up. I know what to do. call this episode here thank you guys for watching if you enjoyed this content make sure you hit that like and subscribe button and i'll catch you guys in the next one